Hello everybody, this is Locke Minecraft, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make entrances to each block on your prison server. So, how it works is, anyone can get into D block, only anyone can get into C block besides D block, anyone can get into B block besides C block and D block, anyone can get into A block except B, C, and or D, C, and B. And here's how we're going to set this up. So first thing, you're just going to want to, for your D block, you're not even going to need any flats. You're just going to want to, hold on, um, this, okay. You're just going to want to select your entrance slash RG define, uh, I'll call this D testing one. So D testing entrance or into D, into D block. So. There we go, we've got a region there, and then we do region flag into D block PvP deny. Because anyone can go in, there's no need for flags. So now PvP's off in here. So you'd obviously want to set parent like this, RG set parent into D block prison, which is your region that this is in. And that's done. Next, your C block region, a lot more complex. You're gonna select it, slash RG define into C block then region set parent into c block prison and then you're gonna have to do some flags so region flag into c block obviously pvp deny but after that you're gonna want to set entry to deny which blocks all non-members from entering the region then you're gonna want to do slash region flag no slash region add member into c block g colon and then the then the group's name so we're going to want to add C block into here so C block can enter. We're also going to want to add B block and A block and any other groups on the server that you have like guards or wardens or owners that you want to be able to enter here. So that's set for C. For B it's a fairly similar process. We're going to do the same commands as so RG define into B block RG set parent into B block prison slash RG flag into B block PVP deny slash region flag into B block entry deny slash RG add member member into B block G semicolon B block and then A block not D and C keep in mind because those are the two that can't enter and then of course any other groups you want to add like guard so that is b block and i'm going to show you how this all works in a moment so then we're going to do a block slash rg define into a block region flag into a block ppp deny region flag flag into a block entry deny rg add member into a block g semicolon a block and of course you could add in any other groups you want just like that and of course we have to set parent for into a block to prison. Now I'm going to D out myself or I'm going to add myself to D block and show you how these work. So menu add Q for D block. GMS D op Q E 1124. Alright, so if I type slash list we can see I'm in D block. I can go in here just fine. This is C block. I'm not permitted to enter. Um, if I try here B block not permitted to enter a block not permitted to enter next oops sorry if i add myself to c block from the console there we go slash list to show you again then i am in c block there we go c block i can go into c now i can still go into d but if i try and go into b i'm not permitted to enter this area as you can see an a doesn't work either. Now if I add myself to B, type in, type in as fast as I can here people. Now I'm in B slash list. There I am, B block. If I try and go into C, works. If I try and go into D, still works. If I try and go into B, it works. But if I go into A, still not permitted. So now if I add myself to A block, I can now go into A block and of course I can use all the other blocks. Now if you had a guard group, you'd want to add the guard group, the owner group, the warden group to every single one. 
So for instance, if we had a guard group, we'd do slash rg add member into a block g semicolon guard. And then we'd do that. Oh, I'm not an op right now, but that's the command you would use. Let me just re-op myself. There we go. If I type that in, it would add guard to into a block, and then we'd add it to b block, and then c, and then d, and it'd be fairly straightforward. And that's how you'd add your guards, so they could go everywhere. So that is how you set up group-specific entrances for cell blocks and prisons. So it's not super straightforward, but uh, that is how it's done. The entry deny flag stops anyone who's not a member from entering. You use the command slash rg add member region name g colon and then group names to add groups to the regions. And uh, there you go. So I'm just going to give you guys a quick tour because I figured it would go along nicely with this video of some of the changes we've made to the prison. This is fortmine.com, but feel free to stop watching if you are bored. So we've added some cool swords. That's donor block over there. We have redone slash warp B. So we've got a whole new layer of cells down here, which I showed you how to make in another video. Um, over here, we've got our, our mines on each side. And over here, we've got our store. This is just chest shop. Maybe we'll go over that later. Um, what else? We, we redid some of A, I believe. Yeah, we did the shops. Um, no, this wasn't some of the stuff we've redone. But anyway, if you want to come on and play, it's fortmine.com. We, we, we have mini games and stuff. This is D block. So if you type slash mini games, we've got our mini games lobby. We've got one in the chamber, CTF, survival games, and spleef. Right now, they do change. But if you want to play, that's what we have. And uh, yeah, thank you for watching. Bye.